Microsoft is going to release Windows 11 very soon. The insiders are testing it and if you want to try it now, you can subscribe to the Windows Insider program and upgrade your PC. We have thoroughly tested Windows 11 and in this video, we will present some useful Windows 11 tips and tricks for you. Before we start this detailed guide, press the like button and subscribe to our channel in case you forget later. The Snap Flyout This one is a new and handy feature of Windows 11. If you often work in multiple windows, this is going to be a big help for you. Just hover your mouse over the Maximize button, then you can select a layout theme. Your current window will go to the first place. Now you can choose the next windows to place on the layout. You can also resize it, so now working on multiple windows is much easier. Also, when you are on the layout and drag a window, the window size is restored so you don't have to resize it again. If you want to make further changes, open Settings. Then click on Multitasking under System Settings. Now expand the Snap Windows section and configure it. This feature is helpful, but I think that Microsoft should give the option to add custom themes. Let's hope that they do that in upcoming Insider Builds. Let's thank our sponsor Malwarefox for this video. Malwarefox gets rid of hidden malware from your computer. It is a simple yet effective anti-malware software providing protection against adware, spyware, ransomware, keyloggers, and all modern cyber threats. Check the description below to download for free. Shake to minimize. When you are working with lots of windows and you want to minimize all the windows except the current one, you don't have to minimize them one by one. Just hold the window by the title bar and shake it. All the other windows will be minimized. To restore them back, shake it again. Although this option in the Windows 11 is disabled by default, you can enable it. Open Settings. Then click on Multitasking under System Settings. Here, enable Title Bar Window Shake. Virtual Desktops. You can create multiple virtual desktops to manage your work. To create a virtual desktop, you can click on the button on the taskbar or press Windows plus Tab button. Then click on New Desktop. You can rename your desktop and also can change the background. Yes, you can have different backgrounds for different desktops. Unfortunately, Windows 10 users can't do it as of now. Align Taskbar in Left If you don't like the Taskbar Center Alignment Taskbar in Windows 11, then you can change it. To do that, right-click on the Taskbar, then choose Taskbar Settings. Now expand the Taskbar Behavior, then select Left in Taskbar Alignment. Automatic Focus Assist Focus Assist allows you to stop the notification and stay focused doing meaningful work. You can configure the Focus Assist to automatically turn on and off at your choice. Open Settings, go to the Focus Assist from the System tab, now here under Automatic Rules, you can set to turn on the Focus Assist during a time. You can also turn it on while duplicating the display, playing a game, or using an app in full screen. Clipboard History Do you copy and paste a lot of items? You can use the Clipboard History to paste multiple items in one go. To enable it, open Settings. Click on Clipboard under the System tab. Enable the Clipboard History. Now press the Windows plus V key to open the Clipboard History panel. Now copy some texts, then click on it to paste it. If you paste a text often, you can pin it. Your Clipboard History can also be synced with the cloud, and it will be available across different devices. Enable it, then enter your password. Here are two options. If you select the first one, all of the copied text will be synced. If you choose the second option, you have to sync it from here manually. Add common folders to the Start menu. If you often access some common folders, you can add them to the Start menu and it will appear next to the power icon. To do that, open Settings and go to Personalization. Now click on Start, then on Folders. 
Now enable the folders you want to see in the Start menu. Windows Terminal The Windows Terminal allows you to open multiple tabs of PowerShell or Command Prompt shells. In addition, there are lots of customization options for you such as customizing interactions, appearance, and using different color schemes. WSL The Windows subsystem for Linux allows you to install Linux virtual machine environments and run Linux-based applications on your Windows machine. To install it, open Windows Terminal as administrator. Now type WSL space dash dash install, then hit enter. It will install the Ubuntu distribution. Now you need to restart your system. That's it. You can use Linux distribution on Windows 11. Your phone app. You can use your phone app to make and receive phone calls and text messages. In addition, with some selected Microsoft and Samsung devices, you can drag and drop files between your phone and PC wirelessly. Open Emoji Do you like adding emojis to your texts? You can do it directly from your Windows 11 PC. Press Windows plus the dot button to open the emoji panel. Here you can add several emojis and GIFs. Record your game you can record your games or a window using the inbuilt game bar. Press Windows plus G. Here you can take a screenshot or record your window. Remember, it won't record your desktop or Windows Explorer. You can only record apps or games. Inbuilt Video Editor You can use the inbuilt video editor app to edit your videos. It allows you to trim, split, add text, and use 3D effects in your videos. Some quick shortcuts. To open settings, press the Windows plus I button. To open the Start Context menu, press Windows plus X. To launch Windows Explorer, press Windows plus E. To open the Action Center, press Windows plus A. You can launch pinned apps on the taskbar by pressing the Windows key and numbers. Press Windows plus 1 to open the first app, 2 to open the second, and so on. That's it for this video. If you have any questions and suggestions, drop them below and share this useful video with your friends. Like the video and subscribe to our channel. Your likes and comments motivate us to create such videos. Don't forget to press the bell button to receive alerts for videos on Windows 10 tips and tricks.